हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल टू दिस वीडियो अबाउट ब्लू स्टैक इमुलेटर दोज माय फ्रेंड्स हु आर यूजिंग द ब्लू स्टैक सो आई लेट यू नो द सेटिंग अबाउट ब्लू स्टैक दैट यू नीड टू नो सो आई जस्ट इंक्रीज द लाइट अ लिटिल बिट डेस्कटॉप लाइट ओके सो व्हेन यू स्टार्ट मेक श्योर लाइक अ मल्टी प्लेयर्स you want to play like uh, multiple accounts so in the setting make sure you select core 1 1 gig ram and select low memory because this is required for the multiple emulator if you are you going to use multiple instances for the the game so you have to select low memory so i can zoom in a little bit so you can see the settings in display you can select this one portrait and 240 dpi medium blue stack Hundred percent default. Okay, then we go to the graphics. Leave it as as it is. I didn't touch these ones. Device I didn't touch. Game pad no. Now we talk about this. So you guys maybe see few ads when you are running Blue Stack. So that is also consuming a little bit RAM. You can say a little bit memory. because whenever the software displaying something it always use a little memory to display ads or anything so which settings we don't need so we don't need number 1 blue stack uh, connect to discord we don't need to connect to discord from uh, blue stack because you are using emulator for your farming account or maybe main account but you connect discord with your app okay so create desktop shortcut we don't need this one the third one we need because us will sign in with google play upon launching a game so enable android sound while tapping we don't need it. and the last one allow blue stack to show ads during gameplay we don't need this and click on disable save the settings if you don't need a notification you can disable the notification as well let's go to the phone you can use any phone you like like a uh, OnePlus OnePlus 3T i'd left it just a just as a default whichever this system picked up data advance so in advance you make sure you enable this because if you don't enable this your bot software will not uh pick this emulator so this should be enabled so that's all guys you make sure do these settings before you start your emulator and thanks for watching have a good one enjoy your game